how y'all doing on the YouTube world? If y'all don't know what I'm drinking, by the way, it's honest green tea. No flavor, but it's real good for you. Anyway, y'all, how y'all doing out there? Uh, today's video is basically going to be talking about the Halloween summons that's going to be here until Halloween. So we have a whole month to get orbs, farm orbs, and pull summons for this exact gotcha. As you can see, you get you get a werewolf Yonimaru. Sorry, I'm stupid. Werewolf Toshiro. <laughs> I'm sorry. Werewolf Toshiro. Um, we have a witch Rangiku. Um, and we have who else? I gotta on this thing. We have Ichi Stein, what I call him, Ichi Stein. And we have uh, I think Devil Rukia or Succubus Rukia. Um, as you can see, there all of them are six star evolvable. You can see uh, read all this. You know, got five star. We got six star. Um, as you can see, as usual, we have. Rukia, I have the moving so like weirdly. Um, Rukia's uh, soul trait is negative 12 strong attack re recharge time by 12%, reducing it. Um, her stamina, stamina for a 5 star is 683, attack is 382, defense is 260, focus is 217, and strength pressure is 400. It don't seem too bad, you know, but it is, it is a 5 star stat, so not really worth too much about it. Toshido's is, of course, freeze duration, 65%. That's a lot for duration reduction. Uh, I heard, the, I mean, not reduction, but duration for freezing. If you freeze, you stay 65% longer. That's awesome. Um, Ichigo's is strong attack by plus 20. And we all need, you know, we can use that to, you know, put on our characters and stuff. And then we have Orihime's, which is 20% stamina between quest areas. Right? Now, that's all great. Great and all that stuff. But for six star, Rukia's didn't change. It's still negative twelve percent. But she, uh, her her killer is hollow, and she gets long reach, which is increased normal attack area of effect, attack havoc, increased strong attack area of effect, frenzy attack hits, blast zone special move area of effect, bombardment number of special move hits, debilit debilitator debilitator increased duration of inflict inflicted inflicted status ailment. And Sprinter, which increases the flash depth like everybody you get for six star. Um, his flash, his thing is still 65% duration. His killer is a Ron car. Um, he got Bruiser, Adrenaline, Havoc, Frenzy. You know, basically the same thing that Rugi got except for. Itchy goes, is still plus 20 strong attack. And his killer is a Ron car. And he has long reach, uh, Bruiser, Havoc, Berserker, which increases the attack, strong, strong attack. Damage. See that? Uh, but nothing special. We got Rangiku! Worth the cast. Dom. You know, her killer is a Ron Car. She has a bruiser, adrenaline, which increases normal attack speed, which is awesome. Havoc, Blast Zone, Weakened Defense, and the defense above on a special move. And Long Stride, which decreases the distance, which is very, very helpful. It's like you're going double flash. You can correct me. And of course, this is the one I've heard. Sorry, this one I heard about so much about is Orihime. Instead of 20% stamina, you get 25% stamina increase. That's the hurt change by 5%. Now, if you're a stamina person, this is the perfect person to throw on as a link. If you're not really an Orihime person, if you happen to get her through the little through the summoning, that's the person you go. That's the person you go for. I would go for that one. I would. But I don't know what I'm going Her killer is hollow. She gets long reach, bruiser, havoc, blast, on sprinter, and medic. Her healing skills affect more team members. Now, if we could get Retsu or Unuhana, they didn't say people, but Retsu or Unuhana for people who don't know her name, Unuhana could get that, um, that skill for six star Unuhana. That would be dope because you know they have those skills where they heal themselves and not affect anybody else. It would be most helpful if you had that one for them too as well. Um, and you know, typical mode across the entire So yeah, that's pretty much that's for the summoning of what we have here for right now. For, for uh, now, now, I got it. Now I want to right now. I could pull one, but I don't know if I get it. So I'm not gonna worry about it. Now that takes care of that. That's the summoning part. Now we're getting down to nitty gritty. Okay, we have the Halloween event. The well, soon my stuff load up. Yep, that's yep, that's the computer for you. That's the precious time.
Now we have the Halloween costume Kerufific. Kerufific? I think that's how you say it. I'm not. I'm. Correct me if I'm wrong. As we see, besides the ones we got right here, we already had the film festival. If you've done this one, you know I'm good for you. I only got I only got up to 250 just to get the whole Gyoku. Everything else is irrelevant to me. I guess I mean I could continue, but I it's, I don't want to. But anyway, not this one. Um, move up, move up. Okay, so anyway, we got Free Yakuya. Now, if you played this game last year, they had the Cherry Blossom Frenzy for this exact character. Where, you know, you would get them for free like Odahime, and you can get these special crystals to boost them up, you know, to get his uh, skill tree. Now, the specifically difference about this Byakuya than last year's is that this one can evolve to a six star. Yep, I heard it right. You can evolve this Byakuya, the red Byakuya, to a six star. That is crazy. Like, I wonder why they didn't do it for Odahime because we had things for fire to that but they didn't do it so um I don't know get over there. but yeah as you can see Byakuya, his soul trait is strong attack damage plus 16 and his strong attack recharge is negative six so this is five star Byakuya. only five star now if you was to go and evolve him to six star his strong attack goes to 16 plus 18 and his strong attack recharge is negative 10. That's dope. And his killer's hollow. He can get long reach, bruiser, berserker, and sprinter, which increases his flash damage. But just like Renji, it will take five Pokeyoku to awaken him. I don't know why it's not six. But it's five. It's really weird. I'm not a whole Yoku farmer, so I don't really have a lot of those. I gotta actually get those. It takes a long time. But, um, but yeah, that's Biakia. Like I was, like Red Biakia. Like I don't, I don't have them because I didn't play this when it came out. When he had, when they had this one, I didn't play it because it didn't. I, I, I lost my password and stuff. It's a weird, crazy thing. But um yeah, so let me scroll past here. So yeah, if you got time, farm that. You got a whole month for it to spare, so you know, do that. But then you also got hold up, let me see if I can get this up there. Go. But we also have the Halloween costume curve for Ruffle. And you can get Ringy from out of this one. Um let me go over here. Um as you can see here, it's the Halloween event. I think it's only going to be here until, I don't know. When. But in between your time of doing, you know, Biyaki, if you don't already have enough Christmas from last year, you can come here and get you a free Renji. Uh, not free Renji, a four-star Renji, mummy Renji looking guy. And he's not really particularly special besides his plus 40. Hold up, I have to get down there first. Well, while we're going down, um, you can see what you can get from the lottery. You can get, you know, coins. This is like the best part about it besides the coins and the crystals. Cause you can always get those. The best part is it is right there. Right, 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 right there. Power hearts. Two star power hearts. And if you're an accessory junkie, you can definitely use these as you make sure you can accessorize, fuse them together. You can get your four stars and aim for a chap. I only got one, and it's orange. So I don't know what to do with that. So I'm, I'm trying to get a blue one. But uh, here's the Renji character, the four star Renji character. His soul trait is 40 plus. I don't know any other person that has a plus 40 stamina soul trait. So if you're a stamina person, uh, you know, level up and soul trait up to 40, you can use them as a link. I'm pretty sure nobody's gonna use them as a character. Um, then you got the other character. You got um, a mind Rangiku, a mind Toshido, a heart. Uh, Ichigo and a heart with a Hime. Now this is probably some I've, I've maxed a lot of these out. The only one I haven't maxed out yet is Rankiku and Toshido. So I'm working on that right now. 
But yeah, go ahead. You know, we got we got plenty of events that you can do so far in this game. As you see, I finished it. I've already gotten my mummy Remy, Remy? mummy Renji. <laughs> um, I haven't done about Biaki yet. I'm, I'm going like get tickets and just spam that because I love Biaki. He's like my favorite captain, my top three captain. He's like number one next to Shizu. So. Uh, yeah, that is pretty much all this video is going to control right now. So, anyway, tell me what y'all more interested in. Are y'all going to summon for this Halloween gotcha? Are y'all not? Y'all going to save up orbs for the for the Zanpakuto one that with the um, Mayuri stuff? I do plan to do that too. I don't have a JP account, so I'm not. Unfortunately, I can't really you know show that news. I'm pretty sure if you want to, you can always go to Cast and Dom's page. You can go to. Uh, Wide, or you can go to um, Blues Cowboys, they, they covered that, and I don't have a JP account with it. So, anyway, like, comment, subscribe on the video. Tell me what y'all more excited about as far as the summonings or the two events that we got that we got for like Halloween till Halloween time. Uh, leave a comment in the below, let me know what y'all think. Uh, like, subscribe. I got a lot more videos coming until then. Soul Reapers, Captains, and Lieutenants. I have a good one.